Cats! Oh my! You're looking abysmal! I was wondering where you were for your lesson. But now I'm I, more worried about you. I just have a hangover, that's all. <laughs> a hangover? Is that why your um, face is bloodied? Because of too much oh, alcohol? No, that's from getting slapped three times and I'm beaten by a... by a shield and breaking my arm. Oh, is Thanks. that all? Oh my. Yeah. <laughs> um... I, I see. Speed up, I should speed up your own natural recovery as well as dull the pain. I would not is recommend using. They're humans. It is a hunt. It is. It uses yeah. the same. Yeah. I would not give you something that is toxic. One moment. I <laughs> probably should get it open. I can't. Right. Thank you. It'll take a bit of time throughout the day for it to fully kick in, but at the very least, the pain should subside. It'll help the arm recover quicker. I would still try to get it set in some way so that it it's it able to. Was. It's an it's an attest, and I'm just I'm just told not to move it. Thank you. Who did this to you? Don't worry. And don't worry about um, what I had to use for that. Well, it'd be All a list of names found. I can't write for the people who slapped me. But in, um, in terms of Everything breaking my fine. arm, that was one of the guards. I was trying to stop the riot yesterday, and I was bashed with a shield. Arm broken. I am so the slaps sorry. slaps just because I was getting into things I frankly shouldn't have. It's okay though. I'm fine. Just hoping this headache will go away. Seems like you're doing what, the, uh, what most others are afraid to do, which is sticking up for those who can't stick up for themselves. Mm. I see it does have a tendency to get you killed, though. Unable to keep my sharp tongue quiet, exactly. I would not feel shame for being the one who cares, because if we all stop caring, then they'll simply just walk all over you. It's happened yeah. time and time again throughout history. I true, true, but, but maybe personally, you should take maybe just a couple days off of caring. Right. Maybe. I'm going to do, do my best to, uh, heal, I think. Very well. I take it you won't be attending lessons? Um, well, thankfully I'm right-handed, but, um... You should rest. I ask for an it extension was a joke. on my homework. Yes, yes, uh, don't worry about <laughs> I didn't it. get it done last night, at least I don't think so. I doubt I did. Don't worry. It's uh, we have all the time in the world as long as you're alive. Right. Wait, yeah, I'm sorry to intrude. I appreciate it. Sorry to intrude. Right. No, no need to worry. I'll leave you be. Are you looking for her? Or were you looking for me? I was looking for you actually. Here. All right. Take care, cat. Um, I, uh, you've met Kyla, the, the drow, have you not? I've seen him around. I have not Steamed. had much opportunity to speak. It, it's a steamed one. A steamed one. All, all yeah. right, that's not necessary. You're both my in friend. my company, and it's simple, simply <laughs> yes. cordial yes, behavior is uh, all I ask. Anyways, looks like my person is here. I'm going to he's got something to talk to you about and I'll be going with the surgeon here I just need to check on my wound if that's okay with you But of course All right. just meet me downstairs Okay. Let me get us some privacy first. Yeah, watch your shoulder Anyway, yes um. Is there something troubling you? 
I... Right. Sit down, I'll if you don't beds. mind. Sit I'll something you take care of it very, very soon. This is very personal. I will make sure that's the next... Uh, I'll make sure the next one I speak to one-on-one -on -one is you. Don't worry, I kept you waiting long enough. So, is something that you don't want to have us to know about, I take it? It's just very personal and I don't understand it and I don't know what it means, so... Um... Right. Every year around this time I keep having the same dream I, I don't know if dreams are... they mean anything. I've heard things around that they, they do. I mentioned it to Mirandel and he said that you would be the best person to talk to about something like that. I, I... It depends on your personal points of view, but too many. There is always sound advice that one can receive from their dreams, especially if it troubles them in the waking realm. Granted that most of the time one does not remember what they do, what they see when they're asleep. The things that they do remember are particularly important to them in some way. Although it's sometimes it's not clear how so. What is this dream though? Um it, it's always the same. I'm I'm in a cavern. A narrow cavern. It's dark. Normally I can see very well in the dark because you know, um... Because of your heritage, yes. Yes. Um, and I'm... I'm being chased by something. Um, it's really hard to see, but I, there's lots of legs. And it's crawling along the side of the... cavern. Um, right. And when I turn to look at it, its face isn't that of a beast, it's that of... A human or, or or an elf or some humanoid thing, but it's always obscure. I don't know who it is, but I recognize it. Um, is someone you recognize yet you do not at the same time? It's the feeling of knowing them but not knowing them, but I don't even see it. It's really difficult to explain. Um, and I also see my mother there. Uh, it probably doesn't mean anything, but it happens every year at this day, so... As part of the beast, or in addition? No, she's... she's there. Sometimes she's standing, sometimes she's... Oh, no, she's not part of the beast, sorry. She's not... but she is not helping you in this situation. Even though there she's may come a time of where usually dead. Or the next day I may have to actually start pricing for small mm. wounds. It was just a checkup. The smallest that I can do. Do you know Very well. I appreciate Is your mother time. alive? We'd all be or is she truly sure. dead? To rot and, ugh, infection. She's very much to dead. With disease and to die with the see. Deep cuts that are near um, Indeed. When people ask me to think to my mother, All right. I just, I don't see her alive anymore. All I see is her bloodied body. I don't, I don't remember her face. I see. Were you, were you present for the actual events of what led to her passing from this life? No, but I that is not too much to I saw the aftermath. See, in situations like these, it is quite often one's trying to find solace or an answer when they don't have one. Especially when the information you described is something vague, yet... It's monstrous, but with aspects of something that is recognizable to you. In this case, the face of something that is not yet beast, yet is part of one. I cannot presume your feelings on the matter. Them being crossed 
Sounds a bit to me like, I guess, some part of you looking for something or someone to blame. And since there is no face to put to it, it goes to the closest likely cause. Especially given both of those general types of individuals having a predisp predisposition to not liking your presence. That much has been clear from the amount of time I've been here in Castle Bedford. Otherwise, it's just... It seems like... Do you feel guilt that you were not there to help in this time? Partially. Because it sounds to me that this dream is some part of you making you relive the emotions that you went through. Running away from something that you do not even know what it is, yet towards a source that, at least from your past experiences, may very well have been a culprit or complicit in this event happening. And the fact that your mother is there is a clever indication that I believe this might be what it is. You said it happens around the same time every year. Does this happen to be around the same time that this event happened in your life? No, it, it's nowhere near. But today is supposedly my birthday, and that's the only way I can really keep track of it anymore, to be honest. It's a bit of an unfortunate way to have to remember a day that is normally meant to be celebrated. I wouldn't know. Almost. Am I cursed or something? I, like, do I need to be worried or, like, never actually told anyone this? Uh, I don't... If you would, uh... If I were, if I were a human or one of the other elves, I'd probably answer yes solely on account of prejudice. Given that it seems that their opinions is that all drow are cursed to begin with. But if you were to ask me, you are afflicted with something, but it is not a curse. But seem more along the lines of, well. Guilt, a wish that something had gone differently, or in this case, that you were able to do something about it instead of having to run from it. Since you don't even know what it was that you ran from other than the one known factor that somebody or something took from you, someone very dear to you. It seems to set you on a path in life that is not really where you are ought to be. I know where I'm meant to be. That is. Oh, I, I don't know. I don't know where I'm meant to be. I'm sorry, I misheard. It's okay, my voice is a little broky. Oh, Whether or not you know where you're meant to be, I would hardly argue that where you are meant to be is in servitude to another. You are your own person, after all. I've said this the same to the other. Who walks with that courier? Sarah. Mm. <sighs> I only wish that there were a way that I were able to help in such a case, but unfortunately, I do not possess any means to physically interact with one's dreams other than perhaps interpret the meaning behind them. You've given me a perspective, that's very... for sure. Really appreciate that. 
life and life and nature have many strange whims and ways about them. There's a lot that many don't understand about it, myself included. But many things do not happen without a reason. But it is up to the one who engages with it to understand the meaning behind it. For they, and you, in this case, have the information needed to discover what it is that some part of you is trying to tell you. Or perhaps that you might realize more than you re realize about the events of the past. While they cannot be changed, they can certainly be acted upon. The answer may be closer than you realize. Thank you for your insight. You've definitely helped me understand a few things. Um, there's... I have no ill will towards you. There's something else. There's a time that something else comes up that you feel unsafe. You have sanctuary with me. Anyways, the other thing. Yeah, um... I don't know how okay this is. Am I at risk of getting myself into trouble if I mention this to you? I am not entirely sure what it is that you would be uncertain of, but... Um... How about this? I will listen to whatever it is that you're worried about judgment free. If it is something that I have objections to, I will leave it at that. I will not mention it to anyone else. But in either case, I will leave. You will stay with me. I appreciate that. You are free to, you are free to speak in my presence. You're good with herbs and plants and and that sort of thing, right? And of course, I would not be much of an apothecary without that kind of knowledge. Um, let's say I had a friend who had an unhealthy addiction to something that is not incredibly readily available. And without this... He would be... His life would be seriously negatively afflicted. Such things are... possible to create, yes. One also would say that creating it would come with risk for... Inherently is a dangerous substance, but let's say if I had if I had knowledge of what this was, or a direct sample of it, I'd be able to see how it was created if it is not simply a plant processed in a particular manner. Um, let's say the friend I have is pretty certain he knows few things about it, including how roughly it's prepared, and doesn't know the name of specific ingredients, but... Hmm. Well, if this friend were able to have it written down or otherwise dictated to me that I may know the manner of which they are requesting and what the necessary ingredients would be I could probably and not even probably certainly be able to create it but I would also advise that friend that if they are truly wanting that that they would also perhaps try to find if there's a way to 
gather what it is that they need from partaking that particular substance in a manner that is not so double-edged. Perhaps find a way to break free of its hold, but that is just me talking as if I were talking to that friend, which is not you, of course. Of course. But mm. if that is what they, if that is what that friend wishes, then I certainly can make it. It is a custom commission, and it would be one that I'd be rather pressed to ensure that it is not readily obvious what it was I was making. Mm, so the friend would have to, cost to it for reimburse this. you, of course. The friend yes. would have. A friend would a friend would not only have to help with gathering the necessary ingredients once they are known, if they are not already available, but there would also be extra to ensure that there is no trouble that arises from it. Oh, not from me, but from those who would object to this being this being a use of my talents. Oh, yeah. <laughs> um well, the friend gave me a name of the final product, at least. Maybe. All right. Out of it. Um, it comes from. It comes from Gradia. Sailors use it a lot. It's called uh, Serenity. That's what they called it. I don't know if you've heard of it. I've most certainly heard of it. I've seen the effects that it's had on some of those who have taken it in the place that lived nearby where I used to inhabit. Are they truly certain that they are in need of this? Are they already in its grasp? Very much so. Without it, he becomes very, uh... ceases to function correctly. Right. Uh, Apparently well, he's been trying to is... wean off it. He's not... He doesn't take it daily or weekly. He tends to take it when... Um, he tends to have attacks, panic attacks or something of the sort. His body's been right. used to the fact right. that whenever that happens, he partakes. Now he can't calm down I've, without partaking. I've, s I've seen... Others who are in a similar state. One moment. Please give me a few more minutes. Sure thing. Just waiting out here. But. <clears throat> if it were anyone else who had not already felt the kiss of such a substance, I would tell them no. But at this point, it seems like it is as much a medical treatment as it is enabling. And while I am a bit loath to perpetuate the cycle of, of addiction, it is still a treatment to ensure that they are able to live as best of a life as they can. But I still feel like that... It might be worth investigating a way to create something that can well, substitute it or substitute for the urges while breaking the addiction slowly. I'm sure the friend would very much appreciate that. I don't think he wants to be Regardless. partaking. Regardless. I know of the name, but I do not know of how it is made, for I have never looked into such things. So if this friend were able to provide at least the best way they could describe of how it is made, I can most likely translate it into what those plants truly are. Apparently it was um, taken from a small root that is found in swamps, very low to the ground. I don't know what it was called or anything like that. Apparently it's shaved and compressed and then lit a flame to... I, I don't know, there may be steps in between, I just know what he's mentioned to me in passing. 
I don't well, think he fully understands that matches the initial, but it sounds like there's more to it. But I might be able to know where to start with that, but if it is, a, if it is in fact a swamp faring route, that might be a bit of a further trek into the forest to find a valid place for it to be growing. <laughs> If they happen to come across any information more specific for a name, then uh, my friend, can you do me I could most certainly of course. Has been try my has best been to do with it. Her left, her left Say the friend had a, a favor, sample of the final product. To, to the uh, a room well, you and I could, to whoever I would ask that, that friend, course, or if you could find this friend work. and... Take this Ask to them if they could All right. lend it to you and discreetly oh, uh, provide it to me. I could certainly analyze it. Okay. I'll have to talk with him and see what I can do. Right. Uh, I've kept you long enough. Friends know that. Let that friend know that I mourn for the condition that's led them to be in the grasp of such a dead, not deadly, but insidious substance. But if that is what has happened, then it is what it is. I'll let him know. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. Thank you so much for your help. I didn't catch your name. Iendel. Iendel. I will just, do my best. Just Iendel. There is no need. I know that there are many who like to refer to me with great honorifics, but I really do not feel that is necessary. So, no great esteemed? Yes. Okay. I would prefer not. Okay. Thank you. Oh, thank you. I'll come out with you. Yes. My friend. But Still. if anything, just to ensure that you're not by yourself. I've been told. All right. I've been told. Uh, to your master. Uh, about your master's gone to the tavern to return uh, a pillow or something. It'll be right back. Hmm. Don't leave here until then. Uh, can I sit outside at least? I need fresh air. You can keep an eye on me uh, if you wish. All right. Thank you. If you insist. All right. Anyways. Yes. Thank you, sir. A lot of lore drop for Kyla. Um, in in those situations, even if he can hear us like through the door, uh, like out of character, he's not going to act on it because that's meta knowledge. He wouldn't be able to hear anything through the door. He won't act on it. He's a good role player. Evening. Perhaps. Morning. Are you looking for I was inside of the building. Tavern. Looking for you. Hello, you. I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to work, but I'll let your people die. How was your head today? Morning. I believe that is not the um. Did you catch any of that? <laughs> no, I was having a headache. <laughs> Everyone was. Yeah. It's been a long night. I'm a little irritated, but mostly because I couldn't get my legs to cooperate with me for some reason. Yeah. It just wouldn't work. I've had that problem before. Oh yeah, I was having a screaming fit. It was great. Oh. Sorry, I missed it. I woke up with a hangover. Where is, um... 
Same! Except he let me sleep in, so it went away. Oh, lucky you. Um, your apparently he's at the tavern. Person. Oh. Apparently I'm not allowed to leave. Well, apparently I'm not allowed to leave here until he gets back. According to the guards. What? Yeah, I don't fucking know. Nothing makes That's sense. stupid. Well, they've upped their presence today, it seems. Everyone's I was age. going to do a bit of exploring today. Exploring? But, mm -hmm. You know, finding the open doors and the open windows and... Little looks and Apparently crannies. he's in the tavern, was what I heard. He is. Let's head our way up there. I don't know about you, but I don't... Actually, they won't Let's take him with us. Too long. He should not have to stay here. here. Specifically. I've been told I have to wait here for him to return, even though I know where he is, and I'm leaving the... the, the, the city. Told, who told you after wait? Me that he'd come, he told me he'd come return for him. Well, I'm going to find him oh, now, stupid. so... stupid. He shouldn't have to stay here. Yeah, I'm li I mean... I'll take him with me. And keep him under my watch. By the way, why would you want to drow within your walls just sitting here, mucking up the place? I get titchy when I get bored. Right. Uh, fair enough. If, you, if, you're out, if you're out the walls, you're out of our problem. Fair enough. Shall we then? What's going on? Is that the fisherman? Uh, it's something about firing yeah, a weapon or whatever. Yeah, the fisherman. Mm. What? Firing a weapon at people? Yes. Things just get, like, worse and worse every day. What, he done it's it not again. just the plague, okay? The plague's driving people crazy. Mm. Mm. Oh, it's not the sickness. This was a peaceful um, time. Everyone's before. hungry. Would you imagine? It was. Mm. That's... Oh. Could, 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 could you imagine the time when what? I didn't have to work up a bunch of people coughing and talking and whatever? Yeah, that's what I'm doing right now, actually. Right now, I'm doing it, I'm going, I'm, I'm going, I'm going. Why are you so slow? Recognize that one. <laughs> I remember that one especially. Don't want to be within the keep. Keep an eye on them. The hunter. Apparently, you find a stone. Strange, isn't it? Reside at the castle, and yet you feel Don't much worry, safer so inside the castle walls. <laughs> you alright? What was that about? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> did you lose him? <laughs> he fucking juked the bird, he juked him. <laughs> that was incredible, where did he go? Impressive. <laughs> All right, uh, wait here for a moment, I'll see if I can find him inside. What do you mean this? The bird looked around and he said, where the fuck did he go? <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. I can't sit today, sorry. Okay. You can sit if you want. I'd rather stand up and sitting for a bit. <laughs> I need to have a talk with the hunter, Mr. Bailo. No, 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 no. Excuse Just me, Mr. Bird. Shoot the bird. Just... Okay. No, don't shoot the bird. It's hey, can you, can you leave him alone, please? He's not food. Thank you. 
Uh oh. Now the tree's upset. I wonder what's next on. What could possibly go wrong here? Oh shit. Uh. Get your damn crow off of me, you fucking drow! I'm not even doing anything. What the fuck did they blame me for? I'm the bird whisperer. <sighs> See what it means about the crow. Nom, 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 nom. You're right. You're quiet. Sorry, I've just got things in my mind. <laughs> like. Had a nightmare. Last night, man. About. It's a long story. Happens every year. It happens every year on days like today. Your allergies? Allergies? What? You said it happens once a year. Your allergies? No, my birthday. You're so very tall. What is going on with my legs? Shadows. Very mm. interesting shadows. Mm. Mm. Oh. This way then, I suppose. Where is there, Roy? Sure. Have fun! Oh, Don't get lost! You knew how to make arrows. We'll be right here. We'll be here, goodbye! He's just gonna leave us. Mm -mm. Yep, and now we're going to be left here, and then the guards are going to come just like fucking clockwork, and we're going to get dragged into the dungeon. Just wait. I'm just gonna mediocrely wait right here. here for now. Like you could do anything to stop them. There's not that much I can do to stop them right now, but given the Are circumstance the of, of everything that's been going on, Who? I'd be surprised if something happens to them soon. No idea. Who are you looking for? No one. I'm asking about them. Are the two of them arguing? Oh. No. I don't think so. They're just talking. Privately. Did a nice little spin there. <laughs> Fuck. Should we go for a walk? Oh, I don't recognize this. Probably a good idea. Let's go. How did you? This is the tavern, right? Oh dear. Yeah, it is. All right. Dreams mean anything for draw. They have like power or something. Dreams? Yes, well, yeah. It depends on what you saw. You're riding a unicorn through a field, it doesn't really mean shit, except you were in a good mood, but depending on certain things you may have seen, it could mean something, and then it couldn't. Do you feel like your dream meant something then? It happens on the same day every year, it's the exact same thing. It happened for years now. Are you going to talk to me about it or what? It's fucking ominous. Um, well, what is there to say? Um, you could say... Oh. Mirandle. He's probably That's looking strange. for me. Is he alright? He's still limping from his injury. So? What are you two doing are at the right? graveyard? Are you trying to add grave digging to your list of accused crimes? We're going to raise the dead, you see. Satanic rituals and such. Ah, yes, of course. No, we saw some... Yes, I'm, to answer your question, I'm alright. Uh, just 
I had to get my stitches replaced. We saw some unsavory fellows entering town, and rather than sit outside the tavern as we usually do, we decided to vamoose. What's interesting, though, is they didn't look like anyone from Dunstead. They didn't look like anyone from the Adventurer's Guild, so... Yes, which is worrying. I wonder who they are. I'm going to investigate, but then you two ran off. Who were with, um... Creepy McCreepface from yesterday. Do you mean... Uh, failed grip? Fall grip? Fall grip? Fall grip? The I don't think of a fall grip, man. He was with royal guards. Those men, they were armed Isn't with simple... Isn't that where you sleep? Platon. What is she doing? She's probably just tending to the hay. I guess I have to move now. Probably noticing a... Oh, you sleep in there? Be careful. In the morning, they usually like to pitchfork it. I've been lucky to avoid it so far. There's not too many animals left anymore. I think I have lodging you with Arn now. Place to sleep anyway. I don't know. He Good. gave me a key to his house, so... Guess I can <laughs> sleep in. Don't let anyone find that on you. Mm, well, sometimes I don't have a choice. I suppose. It's not safe to sleep outside, not anymore. Make sure you're indoors. If you're not, you can, I suppose, come up to the scrivenery and... You know, they'd let me in there. Sleep on the carpet. <laughs> As long as I'm there. I wouldn't want to wake you up. What do you mean, wake me up? Well, if I'm going over to sleep, then you're most likely already asleep or going to bed. Well, you would... <sighs> Never mind. If I can't get into Aunt's house, I'll try and take you up on that. How about that? Fine, fine. Yes. Sure. Pardon me, I'm just a bit short today because of the, um, still healing. Hmm. But, um, what are you two doing out here? You just enjoy the grim silence, or? Well, we told you, there were weird guards at the front. We've literally just walked over here when you came up. Hmm. We haven't been That's hanging where around. where we stand, because if you want to see a little experiment, go stand by that house down there. Come here, Kyla. Hmm? I want you to see just how visible we are against this wall from far away. Yeah. I actually noticed on the way up. You're joking. Well, we we were moving. Exactly. You were moving, so I saw you. But I did remark about that. Anyhow. <laughs> So I guess if we're with you two, we won't get beat up. Are you yes, trying exactly to match idea. the pattern of the stone? <laughs> Am I not? I'm doing a... well, no. This might be your true calling. Uh, you're doing a great, yes. You're wonderful you know, at I did see mimes so in Corradia doing yeah. something similar. Perhaps you could put yourself in a box I never, in the square. I never trusted those. And get some coins. There's no box. No, no, pretend, a pretend box, yes, of course, you know? Why would you pretend to be in a box? It's stupid. I don't know, there's, there's men in Gradia that do it in the square, and it's very interesting. They don't speak they, either. They run on the spot, they, mm. yes, they pull invisible rope. Pull invisible what? Yes, like... <sighs> they do like, like this. So? What are you doing? They do like this. Pretend? They run on the spot, like this. Yes, like that. Like this. Um, uh, how are you good at that? that? That's... <laughs> you could be a street performer. How did you do yeah, that? Well, uh, but... your, your talents are wasted in Ireland, if it seems. You have no idea. Mm -hmm. Everything's wasted here. I got wasted last night. Hmm. Yes, you did. Oh, yes, I know. We did. Oh, oh did, this could did. be interesting. The yes, he room. got so drunk that he uh, mm. forgot to do his homework. No. So he borrowed an inkwell from on. I remembered to do my homework, and that was the problem. He Carry took on. a homework. finger Never to his homework. The concept. <laughs> finger Why the fuck did they give us work for home? Was supposed to work at school. 
and work, not home. So why is it called homework? I'm trying to I learn to understand. read and write. I understand studying. No, I understand the concept of studying and getting an education, but why the fuck do they give us homework? I don't, well, I don't have a home, so it's kind of ironic. What's the point? I just have work. Exactly. <laughs> well, transient work's a bit of a mouthful. I don't know what that means. I prefer to talk to people with Maybe my eyes, own. tell them to fuck off. Watch, ready? Well, you're having this inane conversation. I'm having a very great time watching this halfling try to learn how to use a sword. <laughs> That's Stop another it. thing. I wanted to learn how That's to use illegal. a spear. Do you remember That's when illegal. they used to try to train us in the courtyards? And I would always try oh, to find yes, a way out of yes. it. Yes, you oh. definitely found a way out of it every time. But I also did how much you want every to time you didn't get your way out of it. Cade is freaking mm. the fuck out right now, thinking we got taken. <laughs> oh, well, that's not very funny. <laughs> Find him and make sure that he's not. That is mm. fucking hysterical to me. And I can't wait to go see it. Nope. <laughs> well, if we don't follow her, she's going to get accosted. Maybe we can find out what those men at the tavern want. Ah, uh, yes. Let's have a nice seat in the tavern. Hmm. Oh, right. The drow can't go in. <sighs> so inconvenient, you know? You being purple. <sighs> really puts a damper on things. I'm so sorry. What the fuck? <laughs> That's just a joke. Have any of you He's seen Bayer? Rude. <sighs> Uh, he was I in the courtyard him. delivering deer earlier, but and he was He's in the, the tavern yet getting yelled at Cade. Cade, or yelling at Cade, one of the two. They're still in the same spot we I left him fucking fine. ten minutes ago. Ah, there they are. Well, I'm going to go meddle. <coughs> Don't... Th You're very good at it. Damn it. Well, I guess we are slaves, oh, therefore sure we have to himself. follow, am I right? Fucking <laughs> Oh no, if we don't follow the one that's over, we're going terrible. to get beaten. I mm -hmm. am terrible. Well, let me tell you this. I, uh, Did I you just pick a wedgie out of your butt, or are you limping? I can't tell. I'm <laughs> limping. <laughs> Maybe should pick it out for him. <laughs> you look oh, were you were there when I got caught on the leg. What kind of grown man lives like that? You look like you have shit in your ass that you cannot get out. You leave him alone. He's very delicate. <laughs> that is just Maybe the rudest thing I think I've ever heard. Kate, you can handle your slave. Kate, Kate, look at this man. Uh, Kate? Oh, he's dead. Oh. Kate. Kate! Kate! He looks worse for wear. Oh dear. Oh. What happened to you? Come on, let's go get you cleaned up. See you later. I'll be back. Captain Acosting. Alright. Everyone right. looking at the courier can see that he is bloodied and bruised. I think he was beaten. Hmm. Something we of should be meddling in. I'm going to meddle anyway. No one's going to beat me. Oh, the, the <laughs> captain is. You don't know that. Anymore. I yes. Left before Did I you listen to anything. Um. I'm not sure if I should say this. It's a friendly oh, no. warning to friends until you're found out. Sure. Yeah. Uh. 